drag the star widget out onto the canvas. We'll start by typing in a label. The value allows us to set how many stars are checked. The size is the number of stars. We'll set it at 5. If we have a fraction, such as 3.5, the, the precision will tell us if it rounds up or not. Precision 2 gives us half a star. Here we have our data source with a number called rating. Let's drag a form widget out onto the canvas. This is a really easy way to utilize any of the custom widgets. Let's go through the defaults here. And now we'll drag our star rating widget and drop it right above the original rating. You can see here that it's a data source.items.rating in the value. Let's click our new rating widget and we'll go over here to its value. Click the drop down and select binding. Now select rating. Let's go ahead and delete the rating text box that came with the form. And we'll give it a preview. Click the create button, type in a name, give it a rating, do three and a half stars. We'll create another, five stars and the data saving in the database. Check us out for more great videos at atmakeruniversity.com.